So let's turn now to Art Hogan to talk more about what to expect from the market in October and the fourth quarter as a whole. He is the chief market strategist at National Securities. Welcome back, Art. Nice to see you. Nice to see you, too. Thanks so much for having me. As I understand it, you do not think that today portends uh, a continuation through the rest of October. Is that a correct read? Yeah, I think that's right. I mean, very, you know, we oftentimes we like to look at the start of the year and say, as goes the first week, so goes the rest of the month. And, and I just think it's getting the, you know, the cart before the horse. I think what happened here was we know that the global manufacturing has been slowing. Almost every PMI has been in contraction except for the United States. And now we've had two months in a row where the ISM has come uh, in, in uh, below 50, which means it's contracting. That's the problem. We know that manufacturing is, is, is not faring well because of the U.S.-China trade war. What we do know is that the consumer is faring well. So we've had a sort of a bipolar economy where corporations and manufacturing and the like aren't doing well, but the consumer, which is about 70 percent of GDP, is doing well. So we've got a, a push and pull. This should be a busy month. Typically, uh, it usually is. We get the earnings. We've got this impeachment inquiry now. We've got the Fed meeting coming up. But for you, the most important will be those trade talks with China, right? Yeah. You know, I think this market has really shown us that it's keying on one thing, and that's the tone around the U.S.-China trade talks, the tension, the escalation, and the, the backing and, and, and going back and forth. The tone has gotten significantly better. I think that was true for most of September. August was pretty bad and May was terrible, but September was pretty good and we were seeing both sides have a little bit of flexibility. We, we removed some tariffs or we, or we didn't put new tariffs on until October 15th. And, and on the other side of the, of the table, China has decided to say, listen, we're going to buy more of your agricultural products. So we're moving in the right direction. If that can continue, I think the market can get constructive again. If that escalates and we walk away from the meeting in October the way we walked away from the meetings in August, I think this thing gets a whole lot worse and, and, and the market will start to unravel. So I think that's the key point for October. But you mentioned everything else. We've got earnings season. We've got another Fed right. meeting. On that, on that note, Art, mm -hmm. thank you so much. Art Hogan with National Securities.